Hey, what's going on everybody? This is G and I'm Funkin' Hungry. In this video, we're gonna try Sam Yang Boldak Hot Chicken Flavoured Ramen. This one is the curry flavour. Now look at that fancy package. Gotta love all this artwork around it. Also a genie in a bottle, just bringing the curry, bringing the heat. There's Hochi there on his magic carpet, which looks like it's made of uh, naan bread. So I'll leave the nutrition information on screen for you if you want to take a look. Also, I'll leave the ingredients on screen if you want to pause and have a look. But like always, we'll go through the basic ingredients. So we have the noodles, 73.9%. We have the soup, 24.7%. Now I did say on the cheese one, I wasn't sure if they change up the sauce, but they definitely do because in this one, it has butter flavor sauce. It has artificial chicken flavor, which it had before, milk powder, chicken flavor powder, milk powder, oil, onion, curry powder, chili, pepper powder, salt, chili powder, garlic, cumin, which they didn't have in any of the other ones, then we got powder paprika extract, chili extract, black pepper powder, and nutmeg powder, which they didn't have before. Then we have the flake, 1.4%. That's dried carrot flake, dried onion flake, and dried bok choy. So the cooking instructions are put the noodles and flakes into the 600ml boiling water and cook for five minutes. Then please remove water from noodles. Remain eight spoons of water and add the liquid soup into the noodles and stir fry for 30 seconds, then stir well and serve. Now I will say when I was cooking this, it had a really nice smell. The curry soup or the curry sauce was really nice. It re had a really nice smell to it. it. So it definitely has this curry smell to it. So I'm pretty hyped. And I prefer the vegetable flakes over the seaweed and the sesame seeds. Obviously they work well with the more Asian flavors, but yeah, I guess, Curry's technically Asian, but yeah, the vegetable, but yeah, the vegetables work out really well here, I'd say. So we have our curry noodles here. It smells really nice. Has all those sort of flavors that you associate with curry, sort of vegetable smells and spices. All right, let's give it a try though. Cheers. Mm. That one's funking good really different than the other ones which I like it doesn't taste like the original hot chicken ramen flavor the black packet has a really nice flavor on its own it's definitely unique and it stands out which I like yeah that's funkin delicious I really like that one definitely unique and definitely different doesn't really taste like any ramen I've ever had definitely has a traditional curry flavor though so it has a bit of sweetness to it. It has all these spices and chili. It just, this one's really good. Possibly the best one so far. I did really like the Jiajiang and the Carbonara, but this one, those flavors were a little bit more closer to the original, the black packet, the hot chicken ramen, the original flavor. But this one is just totally different. But this one is just totally different. It's like a chicken curry without the chicken. Yeah, this one is really good. <clears throat> Definitely rate this one. Even the sauce in that one is a bit different, the way it coats your mouth. It's, yeah, does have like that curry feel when you eat it. It sort of sticks to the roof of your mouth a little bit more than some of the other sauces and some of the other noodle packets. Absolutely awesome. So my rating for Sam Yang, the curry flavor, I'm gonna to have to give that a 9.2 out of 10. That's absolutely fantastic. Definitely recommend that. If you enjoy hot food, if you enjoy spicy food, if you enjoy curry, go out there and give that one a try. That one is just, yeah, just blown away by that one. Absolutely delicious. And the last one that I did was the cheese and I didn't really like that at all. I probably was even generous with the rating on that one because I like the brand and yeah, I didn't want to sort of, you know, attack them too badly because I like all the rest. So I'm probably sort of, you know, a bit biased in a way, but nah, this one is definitely awesome. Definitely would get that one again. 
once that one runs out, definitely going to go to the shops and buy some more of that. But let me know in the comments if you've tried the Sam Yang Boldak curry flavor. I'd love to hear if you agree or disagree. And if you haven't, and as I said, if you like spicy food, noodles, ramen, curry, go out there and give that a try. That is absolutely fantastic. Very unique. Very different than any other ramen. It's obviously ramens tend to be more Chinese, Japanese, Korean and stuff like that. That definitely has like sort of an Indian vibe to it, which is really nice and something different. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, if you could please like, please subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss a video. This was G from Funkin' Hungry and I'll catch you next time. Cheers.